Hey guys, we just uh, finished up over here. Uh, <clears throat> it was really busy. It was uh, probably the busiest day we've had this year. And the weather was beautiful and the Lord blessed us with a lot of food and a lot of clothes. And we had a lot of people serving today. Uh, we even had a few folks from Detroit. Uh, we had our, our new friend, uh, Princess, who's, uh, she came over here, she, she, uh, she shared her testimony with everybody over here in the line. Um, so it was, uh, it was a great day of ministry. Guys, I, 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 want, I want to ask you for a very specific prayer, and that's for, um, people in Detroit to actually care about the homeless. Um, that people don't treat them like an underclass because they're not. Uh, pray, for, pray for those people that their hearts be broken. Pray that they feel what these homeless folks are going through. God forbid they ever became homeless. God forbid any of us became homeless. You know, the people out here on the street, they have, they have the same value to God as, as me or anyone that serves or anyone of an upper class. By, by worldly standards. They're priceless. The poor are, are, are priceless to the Lord, just like any of His creation. I just pray, just pray that the people around in the city, the people in the suburbs, that their hearts break for the poor. And that they don't just see homelessness, that they see souls. Give them a heart revelation. Pray for a heart revelation. Pray for a changed heart. Pray for conviction. And keep praying for this ministry. Whatever the Lord lays on your heart, um, we need your prayers. We need your prayers more than anything else that we need. I love you all. Have a great week.